Sen is unique and special because it tells the story of our world. Magnified a hundred times, some sands such as these from a beach look like crystals, but their real beauty shows up in polarized light. This is a single grain of sand, magnified two hundred times under the microscope in polarized light. Polarized light brings out the hidden beauty of sand. It looks rather colorless in normal white light, but the transformation in polarized light is simply breathtaking. This simple lighting technique reveals the intricate structure of a single grain of sand. Viewing sand under a microscope through polarized light is easy and straightforward. All that is required is a microscope, even the most basic of microscopes, and two polarizing filters. One polarizing filter, known as the polarizer, goes just above the light source leading to the condenser. The other, known as the analyzer, is inserted in a light path between the objective lens and the eyepiece. The polarizer is then rotated to obtain striking colors, and any microscope can be adapted to achieve polarization. To see a world in a grain of sand and heaven in a wild flower. It is almost like a world within a world. This dazzling display of colors is for all to see and it awaits your discovery. Sand is broken down granular particles between 1 16th to 2 mm in size. It can be composed of materials such as quartz, coral fragments, basalt, pumice, mica, amongst others. They come about as a result of wind and water erosion over millennia. In every curving beach, in every grain of sand, there is a story of the earth. Sit back, relax, and enjoy nature's marvels. One might even add, it's a visual therapy for the mind. Crystalline silica is found in sand and quartz are most common. The striking rainbow colorations that are produced in polarized light are known as interference colors. It's almost magic. The thrill of looking at sand under the microscope is never ending because no two grains of sand are alike. Every grain of sand is different, and depending on the kind of material sand is made of, some may not show colors in polarized light. These are sand blown by the wind. Next time, when you pick up a handful of sand, look closer. Who knows what you might find in there?